Um, when I was performing my own inspection, I found something interesting. What? When I was inspecting her body, the culprit did not leave a stab wound. Because her chest is covered in blood, shouldn't there at least be some sort of cut? That makes sense. And there also isn't any blood in her hair. Then how did the culprit get close enough without getting noticed and kill her? Wow, they must be a ninja. Is that really possible though? No, I don't think that's it. Was she really stabbed? Um, was Miho actually killed with a knife though? Huh? But her chest is covered in blood. I thought we decided she had to have been stabbed. No, we still haven't confirmed anything yet. Even just the conditions of acquiring a knife, and there's no stab wound to be seen, we still have much to determine. Then where did the blood come out from? Stop with all that fancy talk. Shouldn't we just examine the body? I can conduct a ritual to ask for her permission. How do you keep missing the big picture? Certainly there must be some sort of wound, right? Well, since there's blood, that means some fatal wound must exist. I think it's improper for a man to look, so Maki and I will perform the inspection. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, so we should look around where all the blood is? Yeah, um... Oh! It's true! There isn't a single cut! It's true! This blood didn't come from her at all! Then it's decided. Miho doesn't have a fatal stab wound. Then how did the wolf do such a thing? That. Why did the wolf cover the body in blood? To make it look like a knife was used to kill her. The wolf wanted us to believe a knife had been used to kill her. If so, then only the two people who were guarding the knives in the armory would be suspected, right? That makes sense. Seriously, someone tried to make me look guilty? So smart. Well then, if she wasn't killed with a knife, how was she killed? Hmm. Was there a way to kill someone without anything from the armory? And without leaving a single wound on the body too? It seems impossible, but... I'm gonna tap on the suspicious spot. Her left wrist was there. On her left wrist, there is a small injection site left behind. But really? It's true. It had been covered in blood, so it was hard to find. What is this from? A syringe. Doesn't it look like it came from a syringe? Sure you say that, but... Then, 
Miho was injected with poison and killed? Still, even if I assume that, it's unlikely there's another injury on her body. But something like that does exist. There is an infirmary on the third floor with a medicine box with a needle inside. And not many people here would know if this medication was safe or not. The chances of someone not knowing that this was indeed a poison is very high. Oh, then what about that broken piece of glass we found from earlier? Could it have broken off after the killer had used it? Interesting. Then her looking like she had been stabbed in the chest was just a fake out. But, but that blood looks like the real thing. Where the hell did it come from? Oh, that reminds me. Could it have come from one of the blood bags I found on the third floor infirmary? And they just dumped it on her chest afterwards? Then it was all to hide how she was truly killed. The wolf killed her without using a knife then. Then by that reasoning, those who could have used a knife are the least suspicious, right? How clever! But isn't using a needle difficult for the average person? It, yes, does anybody even know how to inject into a vein? Yeah. This is a key point here for the wolf, though. In other words, the culprit is used to using needles. It has to have been someone who is very skilled at using needles. Just like our psychiatrist, Satoru. Me? Even though I am a doctor, I didn't kill anybody. But with these conditions, you're the only one who fits! How rude. Couldn't you also have used a needle to commit the murder? But even as you say, I am a doctor and I am used to using needles. But why would a wolf decide to kill that way? Certainly, not many people would know how to use syringes correctly, right? But what about Detective Takeo? Why me? As a police officer, don't you see syringes being used often during work? Even knowing what's safe or poison too. Even if I did see it, there's no way I'd learn from just watching. <laughs> I'm sorry. However, the fact remains that she was killed with a syringe. If the killer was a doctor, it seems off to use that unique skill. You agree? That's right! Since I've used countless needles, any amount of struggle would make a syringe impossible to use. And that's why using a needle to kill someone is impossible. That is an important fact you bring up. Yeah. It'd be impossible to use a needle on someone if they've resisted, even a bit. Hmm. There really was a way to keep her still, though? What? That's an impossible feat. A way to keep her still. I, I got it. If what Rintaro is implying, then Miho was immobilized somehow? Well, then how was she immobilized, then? Miho was given sleeping pills and was asleep when it happened, right? On the third floor infirmary, we found sleeping medication. And two, no, three had been used. He's right. I too saw it with my own eyes. So Satoru used these and put Miho to sleep? Ah! That reminds me. I saw Satoru giving Miho some coffee that night. Yeah, about that. Satoru asked me to make him some coffee yesterday. 
But I had assumed it was for him to drink. Hmm, <sighs> suspicious. How do you plead, Satoru? You, you've got it wrong. You're remembering it wrong. But I remember it exactly. Sh shut up. I really do remember it right. I remember now. Back before my stomach started hurting, Satoru came and gave me some coffee. He must have slipped something into your drink as well. Um, trying to talk your way out still. You gave Miho the sleeping pill laced coffee to knock her out. And then after, you injected her with the poison. Next, you dumped a blood bag on her chest to hide that back and make it look like a knife was used. All that was left to do then was cast doubt onto the fact that Takuya was on guard duty alone. Um... Your knowledge of needles, and giving both Miho and Takeo coffee? Isn't that all a bit suspicious? I I'm not the wolf! It's absolutely not me! But, there isn't another more plausible theory. Isn't this pointless? Then it's decided, right? Have you chosen Satoru as the wolf? There's no objection here. I too think Satoru is the wolf. There's no mistake. <laughs> no way! Then if there are no objections, the execution of Satoru as the wolf shall begin. Shit, shit! I'm not the wolf! N no! No! Well then, let us start the execution of Satoru as the wolf. No, no! I'm not the wolf! I'm not a killer! The fact that you're a doctor that killed makes you the worst! Since this time it's a doctor, we've set up a fitting execution. H hey, Takeo, aren't you a cop? You can stop this! Isn't this- is this how justice should be handled? Stop this injustice! Hey! Do something! Aren't you a cop? Well then, let's begin the execution! Stop! If you eat it all, the ceiling will stop. Seconds! <laughs> 